Hello, and welcome back to some more Pokemon GS Chronicles. Dragon's Den. You're allowed to get in here. Player has granted you permission. You're not a dragon tamer. Who let you come in? Flygon. Dang, you're strong. The shrine over there is the home of the dragon's elder. You're not allowed to get in there. One max revive. Dragon's Den Shrine. The sacred place where bonds between Pokemon are tested. You shouldn't be in here. Dragonair. Shell gone. Defeat it again. I just recently got the approval of the Dragon's Elder to train Dragon Pokemon. We haven't seen you before. Who are you? Dragonair. Again.
Shell gone. Again. Ouch. What a disaster. It felt like battling with Lance. The Elder will get mad at you. Don't say I didn't tell you. One Max Elixir. One Dragon Fang. I was waiting for you, Mark. My name is Ryukin, Master of the Dragon Clan and one of the three wise elders of Johto. No need to explain why you came. Claire sent you here, didn't she? That girl is a handful. I see you're holding a keystone. I would like to test you. Not to worry. You were to answer only a few questions. Ready? No. What are Pokemon to you? Ally, Junior, Friend. Oh, I understand. What helps you to win battles? Strategy, training, <laughs> cheating. <laughs> oh, I understand. What kind of trainer do you wish to be? Strong? Or wait, what kind of trainer do you wish to battle? Strong? Weak? Anyone? Oh, I understand. What is most important for raising Pokemon? Ah, uh, <laughs> Viol- <laughs> Violence? <laughs> Violence, love, knowledge. Oh, I understand. Strong Pokemon, weak Pokemon. Which is, mo which is more important? Strength, both, weakness. Oh, I understand. You care deeply for Pokemon. Very commendable. That conviction is what is important. I know why you got a keystone. Mark, don't lose that belief. I wish to see you through at the Pokemon League. So, how did it go? I guess there's no point in asking. You did fail. What? You passed. That can't be. You're lying. Even I haven't been approved. Claire. This child is impeccable in skill and spirit. Admit defeat and confer the rising badge. Or must I inform Lance of this? I understand. Here. This is the Rising Badge. Hurry up. Take it. Thank you.
The Rising Badge will enable your Pokémon to use the ability for climbing waterfalls. Also, all Pokémon will know you as a trainer and obey your every command without question. Claire. Reflect upon what it is that you lack and this child has. Otherwise, you will never learn about true Mega Evolution power. By the way, have you heard of Ho-Oh? It is a Pokemon said to have lived around Bell Tower once. Never mind. Just mad words of the old. Okay. Hmm. Good to see you here. Your arrival is most fortunate. I have something for you. Take this Dratini as proof that I now know your worth. Oh. Thank you. I'm not going to use it. But thank you. Dragon Pokemon are symbolic of our clan. You have shown that you can be entrusted with one. It's been quite some time since a trainer has gained our master's rare approval. In fact, not since Master Lance. You know young Master Lance. He looks so much like our master did in, it, did in this youth. It's in their blood. Oh. I'm sorry about this. Here, take this as my apology. TM93 Dragon Tail. That contains Dragon Tail. Well, Dragon Tail is a kind of... Never mind. It's some huge concentrated power. If you don't want it, you don't have to take it. What's the matter? You've got all eight badges already. Johto Pokemon League is about to be finished, and you can participate in it. Your face is telling me you have some unfinished business. Come on. Whatever you have to face from now, from now, don't you dare give up. If you do, I'll feel even worse about having lost to you. Give it your all. Incoming call, Professor Elm. Hello, Mark. How's it going? I heard you passed the test of the elders, and you got the Mega Evolution power. Congratulations for it. Listen, I've, got, I've gotten hold of something neat for you. Swing by my lab and pick it up. See you later. Okay, we can do that. I do need to grab a flying type from the PC first.
Hello? Hi, Mark. You never cease to amaze me. Thanks to you, my research is going great. Take this as a token of my appreciation. The Master Ball. Thank you. The Master Ball is the best. It's the ultimate Pokeball. It'll catch any Pokemon without fail. It's given only to noted Pokemon researchers. I think you can make much better use of it than I can, Mark. By the way, we just had a group of beautiful kimono girls looking for you. They said they're waiting for you at the Ecritique Dance Theater. Okay. The Pokemon world is amazing. Every day, you discover something about them. Thanks for being my assistant, Mark. No problem. All right. Ecritique Dance Theater. Just in case we need a battle, let me grab Lopany. Hello? I can't believe it. How could I lose to them? Did you see it? I never thought defeating five kimono girls would be so hard. Now I gotta find another way to get the approval of that old man who gives the keystones to Megivol. You must come here for the same reason, right? These kimono girls are insanely strong. Go ahead. See if you can defeat all of them. But I'm not going back. I don't want to see you win. Okay. Goodbye, friend. Welcome. My name is Zuki. I met you previously in Blackthorn City. In order to bring back Ho-Oh, we need... We needed someone with the right bond with Pokemon. The wise elders tested you in different ways. The Sprout Tower, the Keystone, and the test at Dragon's Den. All of this was done just to test your heart. However, being pure alone will not be sufficient to face the power of this Pokemon. I must test you first. Will you take this last test? Sure. Pay special attention to the legend of the sacred phoenix. I will test how closely you've bonded with your Pokemon. Okay. I'm terrified. Noctowl. Umbreon. Can I two shot Umbreon? I can't. Never mind. Never mind. Not with the Citrus Berry, I can't. And Confuse Ray is very annoying. Please don't have Moonlight. Ah. 
That's not good. I don't have any Pokemon left. A day like any other, the wildfire started its madness, and the poor brass tower, its fatal victim. You were quite strong. You helped us when that evil woman threatened us. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. Noctowl. Again. Espeon. Oh, you are truly strong. Thank you. The flames had no mercy of anything around and took the lives of three innocent Pokemon. You were quite the trainer. I remember you accepting the Elder's Test to earn the Mega Evolution. I am Miki, the Kimono Girl. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. Noctowl. Again. Hypnosis. Well, that's annoying. Nightmare. Yeah, that's wonderful. Focus Blast. Why do you have Focus Blast? I did not expect Noctowl to have Focus Blast, and I'm still asleep. This is going great. This is, this is wonderful. I'm having a great time. Good job waking up. And I can't even one-shot an Octowl with Ursaluna. Good job, Ursaluna. Honestly, you are of no help. Larion. Three down. You're good at Pokemon, too. When there was nothing but ashes... The Holy Phoenix, with rainbow wings, descended from the skies and took pity of their condemned souls. Excellent fighting spirit, you attended the call of the wise elder when Team Rocket was invading Goldenrod City. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon.
Noctowl is so annoying to deal with. Rain Dance. Oh, okay. So she probably has Vaporeon then. And the last Kimono Girl will have Jolteon. No, wait. Or this... This Kimono Girl has... Jolteon. Okay. Does this Jolteon know Thunder? Yeah, okay. I was wondering why... Why Noctowl would set up Rain Dance. I thought it was for Va Vaporeon. But it wasn't. It was for Jolteon with Thunder. Because Thunder has 100 accuracy in Rain. Oh, so close. I almost had you. With its golden glowing wings, their lives started to shine again, and the three condemned Pokémon reborn with a new radiant heart. I am the last one. I am Kuni, the Kimono Girl. I looked at you in wonder when you had that exciting battle with your friend to earn the keystone. You must show your strength to me now. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. So this Kimono Girl is going to have Vaporeon. Rain dance again. Okay. Vaporeon. That's gonna hurt. We're good. We win. Oh, you are wonderful. Thank you. We weren't wrong about you. You're worthy of ringing the sunset bell with your heartbeat. Please, take this item. The rainbow wing. A mystical rainbow feather that sparkles. Ah. Uh, the time. The time has come. Mark, we'll be at the bell tower. See you there. Okay. Um, I should heal first. Burn Tower.
That bell you're carrying, could that be? You're the one the kimono girls were waiting for. Feel free to pass. The stairs over there will guide you through the bell chime trail, where the bell tower dwells. Bell Chime Trail. Bell Tower. Your bag is irradiating a strange glow. Is that the... The Rainbow Wing? You have done it. Please come through. The one who holds the Radiant Rainbow Wing and the Pleasant Sunset Bell is worthy of seeing the Sacred Rainbow Phoenix. Oh, there's wild Pokemon in here. Bronzong. One Moonstone. Hold on. Just want to make sure I'm not missing anything. Uh, no. One Max Revive. Oh, TMO2 Dragon Claw. I'll take it. One Ultra Ball.
One fluffy tail. Where am I? One power bracer. One max potion. Wait, what? This is a dead end. One choice band. Wait, that's a great item. Hold on. Who should I give the choice band to? Lopany cannot hold an item. I keep forgetting Lopany has Klutz as an ability. So it literally cannot hold an item. Um... I guess I'll give the choice band to Ursa Luna. Tauros is holding Life Orb. Or should I give... Maybe I give the choice band to Tauros instead. And give the Life Orb to somebody else. For now, let's give the Life Orb to Obstagoon. Nothing. Yes. This is where we welcome ho -Oh. When the dance we practiced for many days becomes one with the sound of the sunset bell, we entrust it to you. Then ho -Oh shall come down from the great arc of the sky again. Mark let the sunset bell ring while your heart glows like gold with the rainbow wing. Sure. This video is going to get a little long, but I think it's fine. Hello? Oh. Hi there.
That is indeed ho -Oh, the guardian of the sky around here, from ancient times. So many have tried and tried, only to fail. Mark, your golden heart and the sunset bell in harmony have finally made it appear. Mark, don't you see? ho -Oh must have been waiting for someone like you all this time. Wouldn't you agree? Um, okay. I'll battle ho -Oh. I'm not going to catch it for two reasons. One, we're not going to use it because I'm only using normal types. And ho -Oh, to my knowledge, is not a normal type. It's fire flying. The second reason I'm not going to catch it is because that's probably going to take a long time. It's a legendary. It has a very low catch rate. I don't want to sit here for 20 minutes trying to catch a Pokemon that I'm not even going to use. So for that reason, I'm going to use Return and try to knock it out. That did no damage. <laughs> Level 63. Burn up. That's gonna hurt. Wow. Look at all that damage. A critical hit. There we go. Goodbye, ho -Oh. Is that it? If that is what you believe, we will not try to convince you otherwise. Still, if you want to see ho -Oh once more, perhaps you can come back here after everything has been settled. You've done a great job. Say hello to Professor Elm for us. Do they all say the same thing? They do. Okay, cool. So... Can I escape rope out of here? Probably not, but I'm going to try. I'm going to try, but it's probably not going to work. Where are my escape ropes? Oh, it does work. Fantastic. Oh, no. It sent me back to the top. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I did not I did not expect it to send me back to the top. <laughs> okay, well that plan backfired. <laughs> Hopefully I can get out of here. Um hello, where's the exit? Here it is. Please let me out. Follow the ladders. Follow. That's going up. We want to go down. Just follow the ladders. There we go. The exit. Wonderful. Okay. Is that it? Are we good? I think now we need to go to Victory Road, right? Yeah. I think Victory Road is our next destination.
Okay, we are going to end this part here. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time with some more Pokemon GS Chronicles. Goodbye.